And on the right side, we have Force of Phil with Jeskai Miracles. Prediction poll starting now in the live chat. Double fetch here for Luis. <laughs> What's on everybody's shopping list for uh, Magic currently, given that we had two sets come out pretty much back to back, the uh, Double Masters and Commander Baldur's Gate? Let me know what's on your shopping list right now. On, on mine, it's a playset of Green Sun Zeniths, a playset of Allosaurus Shepherds, a playset of Food Chains, and... Uh, oh, what's the other card? Uh, oh, and I need three Emrakul the Aeon's Torn. So I'll be carrying around my trade binder for the next few weeks. And that's my update. Magnumus says, is Phil from New York? Phil is in New York. Play set of Ren Sixes. Yeah, I, I do. Th that was like my main shopping list. But if I, but if I can pick up some Ren Sixes by trade or as singles at the shop using store credit, I'll, I'll pick those up too. MTG Banding says, currency converter. Come on, MTG Banding. Currency Converter is from Streets of New Capenna. That's three sets ago. Come on. Catch up already. Dark0842 is here, everybody. Wish I had an air horn. What's up, Ronald? All right, Prismatic ending on the stack targeting this to Ferry. Let's see what happens. Force of Negation pitching to Fairy Time Raveler. Stopping the prismatic ending. There's a really nice new Force of Negation in Double Masters. Is that on anybody's shopping list? Here's Narset. Dark Zero says, I need to buy so many cards from Double Masters. What's, it, what's on the top of your list? What's on the top of your list? Looks like Luis is already way ahead here with both Narset and Teferi on the table against a mostly empty board for Force of Fill. The Planeswalkers are going to be hard to deal with. Can't cantrip, can't cast counter spells. Jace the Mind Sculptor is something. Can't brainstorm, though. Activating it to scry. Putting card on the bottom. Flying Compass is double your credit card debt, Masters. I think the set has most, most of its like value, if, if you're looking at singles. Most of its value in just cards that are strictly commander cards. Am, am I right on that? Or, or there are like a lot of. I haven't really dug through it in the context of modern yet. Like, what do I need from Double Masters for modern? But it doesn't seem like there's a lot for modern that is uh, at least of high price cards. A am I right on that? I know there's Renin 6. 
But aside from Renin 6, oh, I guess Surgical Extraction is a good one. But as far as, uh, I guess the, the, uh, the Eldrazi, well, are the Eldrazi considered modern, modern playables at the moment? Like, is Emrakul used in modern? I feel stupid even asking this. I used to be so thoroughly knowledgeable about modern, but I've, I've been so inconsistent with playing modern recently. I, I can't even remember what the hell's going on. Oh, Force of Negation for modern. That's true. I, I always overlook cards that are also relevant in, in Legacy, so... Renin 6 Borderless Foil sounds good. Dark Zero. Dark Zero 842, one of the best modern players in the New York area. For sure. Displacer Kitten now on the battlefield for, field for Luis, by the way. Okay. Norset getting activated. Oh yeah, Cavern of Souls is a good one. Cavern of Souls Cavern of Souls is used a lot in modern, right? I'm I'm assuming. Must be. Is As for Told still a deck in modern? Do are people still playing that? That was hot for a minute, but I, I haven't heard anything about it in a long time. I feel like such a fool asking such basic questions about modern. <laughs> but I just haven't been playing recently. Monastery Mentor. Engineer explosives, and that's game. Phil has seen enough. Luis up a game here. As for told, got replaced by Cascade decks. Okay. I like that Charlotte's agent is getting a chance to shine. Oh, either Vial is in um, uh, Double Masters as well. I forgot. Season Pyromancer, that's true. Season Pyromancer's in there. Yeah, I guess there is a lot for Modern, huh? Some good reprints. Yeah, Vile might be more of a legacy card currently. Coco with a great question, and maybe I should have explained this earlier. What is the Displacer combo? So Displacer Kitten has a triggered ability. You can blink something whenever you cast a non-creature spell with a card like Teferi that bounces something else. You can just blink like Luis did earlier on stream, blink Engineered Explosives, which caught zero. I mean, blink Teferi, bounce Engineered Explosives, which caught zero, cast it again, trigger Kitten again, Blink to Fairy, return engineer explosives to hand. You see, you see the, uh, and every time you bounce, you're drawing a car with a fairy, so you can basically draw your, as many cars as you want. Did I explain that well? Green Sun Zenith reprinted. Green Sun Zenith is not in modern, but that, that's a good reprint. <laughs> Counterbalance for Force of Fill. There are other cards you can use with the kitten, but I was just giving one example. Um, other decks are using it with uh, Lion's Eye Diamond and Karn, for example. Uh, you know, there, there, there's a bunch of different things you could do with it. Yeah, it's 
Give him a uh, all forces. Okay. Force pitching Narset on Snapcaster Mage with the Red Blast in the graveyard. No longer going to uh, get flashback. Counterbalance appears to be safe for now. Any modern players watching live or watching later? in the comment section, what, what are the top tier decks in modern right now in your mind? Top three decks, top two decks, what are they? Is there an S tier deck in modern? We were talking about this at the shop the other day. People have a bunch of different takes on it. It seems like no, nobody's on the same page about it, to be honest, as, as, an, as an outsider currently, being that I haven't been playing the format that much recently. Power Blast on top prevents the uh, Red Blast from resolving. I trust Dark Zero's opinion, Mert Tide in four color. I see a bunch of people in chat agree with that. But is it oppressive or are those just the two top decks? Like, obviously there are always going to be top decks in, in any format. Um... Are they too good, or are they just the best decks? Which is fine, because they're always the best deck. At least in my mind. Ooh, what's that? Was that a Flusterstorm? That was like a promo Flusterstorm or something, right? Have you played one Yeah. What's up? Have you played a line over yet? I think you were on the floor. I'm gonna play a happiness on my card. Okay, yeah, yeah, then I can't play this. Oh, oh, okay. Cool. No, I can't play this because I, I blocked it and snapped it. Sorry, Fred, this is. Yeah, I, led, I went this, 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 played this, and now this, I believe, is. Did I miss something? Maybe I did. Maybe I did. Uh, yeah, if, if we're on... Yeah, yeah cause you had, you had land, land, fetch, fetch. Yeah, yeah so maybe I missed land. Okay. Yeah, it's time. Uh, Alright, players sorting out lands. Narset, I mean, um, Prismatic Vista comes down. Narset is on three. Force of Phil fetching and firing off a Power Blast here on Narset on the end step, it looks like. RBS says, when was the date of this event? This was four days ago. Monday evening. And it is now Thursday afternoon, my time. Narset getting cast for Force of Phil now, and we're seeing a fetch in response. And Treat the Angels getting revealed on top, but I'm not really sure why. Okay, a brainstorm was cast in response, so it must have been verbalized, but we didn't get to see it yet. This is in response to Narset, not with Narset already in play. Treat the angels on top of the deck, but can't be cast with the mat lands in play currently. So, Tundra, Volcanic Island, Mystic Sanctuary, and Island on the battlefield for Force of Phil. Phil Blackman of Eternal Dirtles. Go check out their podcast. Looks like Narset picked up a brainstorm off the top of the library and passing the turn now to Fairy Time Raveler in hand for Luis. I wonder if we'll see that get played here. Could be a good way to uh, deal with counterbalance on the way down. 
Once it's recast. Do you have it right now? Show you likewise. I, I, I just have it marked. I'm not here for them. Seven, uh, I took three, so it's not going to happen. All right, an update of life totals. Thank you, Phil. Up a game trying to figure out how to fight through Narset and counterbalance. Mystic Sanctuary. I'm assuming I'll we'll put a red blast on top. Yep, that's easy choice. Now let's see if Teferi gets cast here. I'm wondering. Ooh, the kitten. Reveals force and negation on top, so it'll resolve. Pass the turn. Minusing Narset. Side Norna is here. Says, why does Phil have four lands tapped? I'm uh, I'm not sure what happened last turn. Is Narset and maybe the Power Blast? I don't know. Savine's Reclamation in hand for Luis as well. Expressive Iteration found off Narset for Force of Fill. There's a Brainstorm. Seventy-one percent favored for miracles," said Twitch chat before we got started. About seven thousand channel points on the line. There's a tundra. Draws the red blast. So I think Flusterstorm to Fairy, Savine's Reclamation, and Red Blast are the four cards in Luis's hand. Force of Negation. Flusterstorm could do something. All right, counterbalance is gone. Attacking Narset, very nice. Yuri on to hand, looking pretty good for Luis at the moment. Kitten plus Yuri on, things start to get kind of silly. Iteration getting cast here. Is Nurse it? Attacked by the kitten. Savine's reclamation. 
Targeting Narset, I'm assuming. There it is. We'll get minus. Pursue in the chat. Excited about the foil borderless kitten on the table. Card's looking good so far. There's Fluster Storm. Septimus says Kitty is pretty OP. Yeah, it's, it's looking good. It's looking good. I love when cards, new cards, become uh, legacy staples. It's one of my favorite things. Jace balancing the kitten now. JH Stock, one of our best people. Resub just now with Prime, five months, and says good evening. Good evening, JH Stock. Good to have you here. Appreciate the sub. Tapping five now. Are we seeing a flashback or a Urion? Oh, never mind. He's thinking about what to do here. Looks like we're going to see a flashback of Savine's Reclamation. Narset and a land? Yep. It's going to resolve. Narset will get activated. That'll shut off Jace, Jace's ability to brainstorm for now. Which is important. Luis prioritizing, getting a nurse set in play. I, I think I like that plan. Hello to all of our viewers in Brazil. I know a lot of you watch the channel. Appreciate all of you. Get a lot of friendly messages from viewers in Brazil. Some friendly people. Here's counterbalance. Jace just ticking up. It's a fairy time raveler on the battlefield for Luis. Planes is drawn there for turn. Bouncing counterbalance with Teferi. Activating the Nars set. Force negation with Flusterstorm are options. Force negation will be the pick. That can deal with counterbalance, potentially. Will the kitten come back now? Yep, there's the kitten. This could get ugly for Force of Phil. Mystic Sanctuary for Force of Phil here. Does Phil have a Power Blast or Red Blast in the yard? No, but it looks like a Lightning Bolt is an option. It's behind my face right now. Yeah. 
So there was a Pyroblast. I missed it at first, but a Pyroblast is now in hand for Phil. Retreat off the Mystic Sanctuary. Counterbalance will be the play. Force of Negation is in hand for Luis. We know that. And it'll get fired off. Triggering the kitten to blink Narsa. Narset comes back with full health. Bouncing the kitten now with Jace. And power blast on Narset. Phil cannot use instant speed spells, so Flusterstorm will do the trick here. I believe there are four total copies, which Phil cannot pay for. And a Ponder. Won't be able to draw the card, though, unfortunately. And it'll be a shuffle. Fetch of Mystic Sanctuary now for Luis. Red Blast gets found. This is coming together nicely for Luis, little by little. Plus on Teferi, minus on Narsa. Finds another force of negation. Just a note, remember, t you're supposed to randomize the cars that go on the bottom of the library from Narset. They don't go back in any order. It hardly ever matters, but that is the correct use of the ability. Blowing up Phil's Narset. Now activating Narset. Ponder here. Blinks Narset. So we could get another Narset activation this turn for Luis. We're seeing now the uh, kitten can be pretty, pretty gross. Draws off Ponder. Minusing Narset now the second time this turn. Finds a red blast. That's a good way to deal with Jace. Blink Narset again, potentially. Red blast, blink Narset. Minus Narset again. Another power blast was found. All right, Luis offers to show the hand at Phil's request, and, and this game is over. 